What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, we're drawing the Wither from Minecraft. Now this character has three heads, one large one in the center and two smaller ones on the side. So let's start with the center head. Starting all the way over on the top left, draw a straight line coming all the way down towards the bottom. Now we want to take that same length line and come down at an angle from the top. Starting up here, angle down towards the right. Now we're going to draw that same line along the bottom. Just going to line this up on the right side. And it will close out the side with a straight line. Let's go back up to the top and draw the top edge of the head. Starting on the top left, angle up towards the right. And then again, we'll take that same length line over on the right side, going up and out. Let's close off the back of the head with the same angled line we have in the front. Now the smaller head over on the right is going to overlap the side of that center head. So let's start from this point, we're going to draw a straight line coming down about halfway. So we're going to pull this down to right about there. And then from here we're going to angle down and in. Now let's draw on the top of the head. From this point we're going to draw that same angled line coming down and then out. Go to the inside, draw that same angled line to right about there. Close out the side with another angled line. Let's go back to the inside, draw a straight line coming down towards the bottom of the head, and then we'll take that same length along this point, coming all the way down towards the bottom. Let's close off the bottom of the head with another angled line. Let's move over to the back of the head, draw that same length line, coming down, and we'll close off the bottom with another angled line. Let's go to the bottom corner of that center head, draw a straight angled line coming in behind. Let's move all the way over toward the left side and draw the third head. From this point, I'm just going to angle down and out. Now we're going to pull this all the way up towards the top, taking that same length line up, right about there, and then taking the same angle, go up and in behind the center head. Let's go all the way back up to the top, we're going to angle the head, going up and then out, come straight down the side with that same length line. And then we'll close off the bottom of the head. Let's go back up to the top left, angle up and in towards the back, pull it down and in. Now that we've drawn in all three heads, let's draw in that center spine. We we'll move to the center of that middle head, draw a straight angle line, coming down, all the way down toward the bottom of the spine. Let's go back up to the top, step over towards the right, draw another straight angle line. It's going to come down a little bit lower along the bottom. We'll take that same angle line and close off the bottom of the spine. Now let's draw the ribs on the left side of the spine. Starting from the top, we'll step down, angle up and out. Come down in an angle, right about there, and then pull that back in towards the spine. Now we're going to draw that two more times down below, leaving a gap down and in, and we'll follow this angled line, come down towards the bottom, pull that back down and in. Let's do that one more time, stepping down, angle down and in, flatten off the end, and then pull that back in. Now we're going to continue these ribs over on the right side of the spine. So let's continue this line, coming down and out in behind the head, step down, go down and across, and we'll pull that up and in underneath. Let's do that two more times. Stepping down, go across the top, we're going to follow that angle line, come down, and then we'll line up the bottom. And then one final time.
Now we're gonna draw the top face of each rib. Start from the top corner, angle up and in underneath the head, step down, pull this up underneath, and do that one more time. Let's go to the inside of the top right rib, angle this up underneath the head. Let's go to the bottom corner, angle up and out. Step down, draw another angled line, come down to the bottom. Now we're not gonna go all the way, I'm gonna stop right about there, and it'll follow that same angle line coming up underneath the head. Let's do that one more time. Closing off the top and bottom, and then the side. And then from the top, I'm just gonna angle this back underneath the top rib. Now we're gonna go all the way up to the top and draw the back of the rib in between the heads. Now the bottom of the spine bends out towards the right. So from this point, I'm just gonna angle this out, go to the inside, draw that same length line, and then we'll close off the bottom. And then from the bottom, angle up and out, Follow this line coming in with a short line, and we'll follow this angle going back up underneath the ribs. Now let's go back up and add the face starting with the mouth. From that bottom line, on the left, we're gonna step up, draw a straight angle line coming across, go up the side, and we'll close off the top. Let's do the same thing on the heads on the side. Then we'll go back to the center head and draw on the eyes. Over on the left side, angle down and in, and leave a gap in between the eyes. Go back to the inside, draw a straight line going all the way up towards the top. And then we'll angle this up and out towards the left, and then come down on the right. Let's do the same thing to the other heads. Now we separate the eyes in half with a line going across from left to right. Starting on the outside, so we come down and in, continue that over on the right. And then from the bottom half of the eyes, we're gonna draw a straight line along the sides. And do the same thing along the left, and then the right head. And that's pretty much it. There's the Wither from Minecraft. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. Make sure you subscribe and send me your request in the comments below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.